First of all, we strive at King County every day to protect our environment. And this is not, and I appreciate the introduction, but this is not about me, though uh, the environment really is and has been for a long time my priority. But this is about uh, those who came before me, Executive Triplett, Executive Sims. It's about the county councils uh, that have served this county. And most importantly, it is about our employees who are not simply showing up and clocking in and doing a prescribed set of routines. They are thinking about how they can improve the work they're doing and improve the work we're doing on behalf of our natural environment. Uh, we're improving energy efficiency. We're reducing climate pollution from our own operations. We're working with the region to promote sustainable development and protect open space and protect Puget Sound for those who come after us. The decisions we make today about our built environment set the stage for healthy citizens, a healthy environment, a healthy economy tomorrow. According to the US Green Building Council and common sense as well, the environment, um, the built environment has a profound impact on our natural environment and on our economy and on our health and on our productivity. In the United States, just by way of example, buildings account for nearly three quarters of all the electricity consumed, nearly 40% of all energy used, almost one third of all waste output, and about 14% of all potable water consumption. This administration is focused on reform, on continuous improvement, and on making King County government work for the people we serve. These concepts come together in a powerful way when we push the envelope on green building and operations.